Shalom Israel. My name is B. Will, and today we want to talk about some things here. I'm going to do a quick thing. You lie, you die. All right. I'm asking you, Army of Israel, to step up. I want to know who you're praising. I want to know who you're calling out. You got to seem like you got a good message and all of this, but uh, I want to know what name you're calling. So let's go and find out here. This is Hebrew New Year's New Moon Service and Exodus, first chapter, part two. I just want to hear hear some is here. See. I ain't trying to see you. I ain't trying to see you. I don't want to see you. Okay. mistaken I've already asked you to step up I've already called you out in one of my videos I'm calling you out again I want to know who you serving who are you leading my people to I hear you talking about somebody else but who are you leading our people to Yeshia who tell me Man, did y'all catch that? The white boy even caught it. He changed it up. He said, this is alarming God. He changed it up. See, they they know. You don't know nothing. Rise, Israel. Knowing who you are. It was Jacob. Chosen as the first begotten son. True believes come before the New Testament every day of the week. So what name are you calling out? Be 
hell, but hold on. But I'm telling you right now, <laughs> if you refuse, it's going to be a problem. <laughs> I can't un I can't understand what the what the argument about it, talking about another leader when you calling out a name yourself. Show me where you got the name from. Show me. Show me the name in the new on the Old Testament. Show me. Because Jubilees come before the New Testament every day of the week. I don't care if you're calling him Jesus. I don't care what you're calling him. It's all the same. Man, I, just, I just look at this, man. And, and this, is, this is the Lord. I mean, this is the most high talking to these Sunday Christian church calling people, man. You hear the white boy? He gets it right. But why can't you? Israel. See, they know. You don't know, Israel. You won't take in consideration. You won't even let it be a thought in your mind. Now, for all of you out there that do understand what we're talking about, it's time for you to raise up. I know you, 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 you understand, I know you understand what I'm saying there, but I wanted you to understand really. We we got to grow. It's time to raise up. We need we need soldiers out there who want to know the truth, who studying for the truth. We don't know everything. We don't know nothing. But we looking for those who's looking for the truth. Is it not the rainbow? what the Most High gave to Noah to bear witness? Is it not? The, 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 the truest image you can get of light. You don't know what I'm talking about! He's talking to no Christians, but he's talking to he's talking to Israelites then. That the new day was Israel. They knew. He's talking to you. Israel, wake up. Young brothers, wake up. I see y'all have the heart. Knowing who the Lord is. Knowing what you call it. I hope and pray you ain't calling out no names. We're going to check it out, though. Who there was Israel in the whole nine, okay? He, they knew, but yeah, he talking to the ignorant of our people, too, because he said Israel in um, Isaiah 1 and 3, the ox of his own hands, and asked about scripture, Israel do not know. My people do not consider, right? So, yes, it's talking about that as well, okay? You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of people don't want to consider that they're the children of Israel. But we know that they're not keeping the new moons. We know they're not doing this. They keep it in pagan holidays. You see what I'm saying? Okay? But but, but this is but but you know, in context of everything is talking to any Hebrew Israelite that's not trying to follow the most high by some of my stuff. What name did you just call? Brother? What name did you just call? See those people? These are seals. And these seals calls out names of different fallen ones. GOCC and the rest of them are doing, trust me. So brothers, I'm asking you, what are you doing? Our Father says he has no name. You can find this in the Apocrypha of John. He says, I don't have a mother. I don't have a father. I'm more than a God. I create gods. He never named no son, no Yasha Baka Waka Waka. He named him Jacob. And I'm saying it like that to get everybody to understand.
It was no J's. But it definitely wasn't Jesus or any other name. Challenge me if you will. You need to come to the lion's den. Yeah, I heard this, people. Let's hear it again. Let's make sure I didn't make it up. Let's see if he says say some name. I don't want to repeat the name, so let's let hear him say it. Talk to the... He talking to the Israelites then, that the knew they was Israel. They knew they was Israel. You don't know you're Israel? You don't know that you're Israel. What was the first thing that the Most High gave to Noah? Wasn't it the bow in the sky? But where did that come from? What is that? Oh, that's the art that's the, the, uh, the art of his covenant? Huh. So this is what you're saying is that's the first light, but you're going to call out another name. You're calling out lords. Lords is beneath our father. See, we used to be over the what you want you call lords. We used to be over the beast. It was man that was given dominion over the beast. We gave up our title. With Eve. Genesis 3 and 1. So what are you talking about? Because you ain't talking truth. I see you doing the right calls. I see you, you, you're going by, by, by what you've been taught. But is that the truth? Is that what's really being said? Is that what's really being done? You calling out names? Oh, look. But I'm telling you right now. <laughs> If you refuse, it's going to be a problem. <laughs> hey, God. Yeah. Man, I, just, I just look at this, man. And, and this is this is the Lord. I mean, this is the most high talking to these shirts. You hear that? The white boy got it. Hey, God. Yeah. Man, I, just, I just look at this, man. And, and this, is, this is the Lord. I mean, this is the most high talking to these Sunday Christian church going people, man. He is pissed off. He is pissed off. You don't even know what to say. Let me say it for you, bro. Genesis 3 and 1. Genesis 3 and 1. Now the serpent was more subtile than any beast of the field. It was only man and beast. You ain't understanding. You ain't knowing. Which the Lord God. Don't say nothing about Lord. It don't say nothing about no hakabaka dikadaka. No it don't. Had made. Who made it? Lord God? So it wasn't Lord that made it? Huh. How can a Lord create, make himself? What are you talking about, bro? Alright. Look here. Who's the first person, first thing that Eve spoke to? Wasn't it not the serpent? Which in Genesis 4 and 1, she turns around and gives praise to by calling it a Lord! White boy caught it. Let's go check this out, though. Let's see if I'm mistaken. We're going to go to Genesis. It's Genesis 6. Genesis 6, people. Genesis 6 and 6. And it repented who? And it repented what? And it repented the Lord that he had made man on the earth. Uh-oh. What does that mean? <laughs> Shut up! And the Lord said, I will destroy. Huh? What? The Lord! Each and every one of these groups, people, are calling out fallen angels' names to gain power. You give them power when you give praise to these names. 
Our father says he doesn't have a name. He has no mother. He has no father. So who is this they call it? Because it was Jacob who the Most High called to be his firstborn son. Which we know is Israel. So I'm telling you brothers, while you're teaching the people lies, understand this. You are the fulfillment of your Jesus, Yahweh, all this image and emery, idolism. You are the fulfillment of this. It was your ancestors that was beaten, put in slave. It's you they throwing in prisons and on drugs, abortion clinics. It's you, Israel. Jubilees 2 and 20 comes before the New Testament any day and every day. So what are you talking about? Who's the Lord you serve? I'm asking you fellas, you young brothers, to come and step up under the rainbow. If your leaders don't want to follow you, question them. Watch my videos. Question them on what I'm showing you. And see how they squirm. We need all the help we can get, Israel. It's time to rise. We can't keep staying in this state. We have to rise up, Israel. Get off your bellies! Squirming around like a worm or a serpent. Rise to your feet. And for the rest of you, grow your wings. Help out your others. It's time to rise, Israel. It's time to know that you are the fulfillment. Not these demon liars. Why are you giving them $50 a plate for Passover? I own a farm, people. Get in touch with me. I can get you all the, the, the lamb you want. I raise my own animals. I'm not going to be eating whatever they tell me is a chicken and whatever else if I can do it right so what are you doing what are you teaching what kind of meat is going to be on that plate what are you going to be eating something you done bought from the government one way or the other Israel we can rise we can do this all ourselves we must unite we must grow our wings, the ones that are ready, that understands the rainbow. We must come together. We must fight for breath. That's what we must do. We can't have and allow this kind of teacher and doctoring. Now, this brother may be trying to do the right thing, and I really do feel like he's trying to do the right thing. Only time will tell if he will face the lion's den. If he won't face the lion's den, people, every one of you should know that's up in Cleveland, Ohio. Telephone number 770, area code. <laughs> he must face the lion's den. He's calling out false names, fallen ones. I'm showing you people. Ask him to step up make him step up make him don't donate nothing to them take back your money what are you eating don't let them fool you our father never told us to go to the grocery store and buy nothing he told Adam to work the field to work the land what did Jacob do What did Abel do? Cain and Abel. He never told us to go to a grocery store and buy nothing. You don't know what you're eating. Like I said, I got real lamb. Matter of fact, I got one in the tree right now. I know y'all don't understand what that means, but yeah, I got one in the tree right now. 
what do y'all got? Not talking bad about you, but don't be deceived, people. Now, we can work together, hopefully, by next year. We can all work together by next year. I can, I can supply all the ones who wants a real dinner, one way or the other. We can figure out something. Let's work together, Israel, not apart. If these leaders will not step down and keep teaching these lies, these blasphemies against our Father, our Creator, then we need to let them go. Stop supporting them. You seen one of their mans with an earring in his ear? Big old diamond. So I ask you, where's the money going? Is it going back to the people? Is it going back to the children, the women, the suffering? Or is it going into your pockets? Is it going on earrings, cars, rent? Who's rent? What about our little children out there that don't have no food? $50 a plate is kind of expensive, bros. Especially for something you're buying at the grocery store. Come on. You still trusting in a white man to, 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 for, for him to give to you. And I'm telling you now, I have lambs. And I can get more. I can raise a lot more if I had the support of our people. Because I do whatever it takes for us to rise, Israel. Because I know who I am. I done split the wood. And I done lifted the stone. Now it's up to you, Israel, to figure out. Some of you already have. These guys ain't telling you the truth. It's Jacob, not Jesus, not no Yahweh, not no Hashar, whatever. That's this, people. That's who that is. My name is B. Williams, and I'm out of here.